We have a family circle letter. Who's that? Like, my mother started it. She wrote a letter. She sent it to my oldest sister. And she read mother's letter and wrote a letter. And then she sent my mother's letter and her letter to my next sister. And uh, she wrote a letter, read their letters, and then, and then she wrote a letter. And, and then it kept on going around the whole family. Wow. So in the end, you would and, get a lot of letters. Yes. Oh. And, and this last week, I took it down to the post office, and she said, you owe, I had uh, a forever stamp on it. And she said, you owe 15 more cents on it. <laughs> so you guys still do this? Uh-huh. So who's it's, in the circle? It's been going on for, well, before we were married, and we've been mar we'll be married 58 years in December, what? and it was going on long before that. That is so special. That is so cool. So how many people are in it? What is it called? A family circle letter. And, and how many people are in it now? My mother passed away, and my oldest sister passed away. So it's Anna Mary and myself and Clarence and Elam and Naoma and Arlene and Irene. Well, Irene passed away. And, and one niece. And one niece took my my oldest sister passed away. And then her daughter started writing in her place. That's so cool. Are they and just write one one page letters, or are they longer? However long you want to make it. That's so cool. Yeah. So it, obviously it has an order of yeah. where it goes. Yeah. And we date them so that we know. So who gets it, it last? It's, it's, the person who gets them last gets all the fun. Gets. No, 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 you you get all you get to read everybody's letter. Oh, okay. And then you you take yours out and put a new one in. Oh, oh, so they just it just keeps going. Yeah, it just keeps going. going around and around and around. Oh. When I send it to one of my sisters and and uh, she reads all the letters after she wrote hers and reads mine last because mine was the last one in it. Then she writes a new one and sent it around again and as it comes to you you take the old one out and write write a new one so here's a big question did you save all your letters no oh see that would have been that, awesome well we'd have boxes i know that's so cool <laughs> that is, I, that's probably one of the most amazing family traditions i have heard of that is yeah awesome. that, that's an old time tradition wow do you know anybody else who does that not personally, no. Huh, I'm going to look that up, too. You guys are giving me good stuff to look yeah. at. Wow. Yeah, it's... That is beautiful. It's been going for a long time. And how old is your niece? Is she the youngest one? Yeah, she's... She's in the 50s, isn't so, she? Lois. So she's, she's the... She's probably 50. She's and the she youngest does, one? In the circle? Oh, oh, oh who's yeah. the youngest one in the circle? In the circle. Oh, oh yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah. She's the youngest one in the circle. Who's the oldest in the circle? My... My sister is, she just turned 89 on the 10th of this month. Uh -huh. 89. So what did her last letter say? What was she doing? What, was she, what does she write about? Family things. Yeah. What all the family is doing and things of that sort. Aw. Yeah. If graduations or what your granddaughters are doing and stuff like that. Where's she at? That, that sister... Is, was my second, she's older than me, uh -huh. and she lives out in Ohio. In Ohio, oh yeah. That's and so then, cool. Then I send it to my sister in New Holland, Pennsylvania, mm -hmm. and most of us are in Pennsylvania. Oh, that's, uh-huh. I guess, and Mary's the only one that's out of state. My sister that sent it to me, my oldest sister mm -hmm. that's living, uh, lives in Ohio, and she's the only one out of state. Now she starts it, or who start? Your mom started. My mom started it, and then it was my oldest sister, and she died. Mm -hmm. And so now it, it's the one out in Ohio. In one the Ohio, one. And so she's oh, okay. And wow. Then, so did you put it in another envelope? Yeah. Yeah. So, okay. And then I address it to my next sister. Yeah. That I send it to. Her. All handwritten. Mm -hmm. Wow. That's amazing. I'm so excited about that. And, and my, my niece. I'm printing. Huh? My niece prints. Oh. Because she learned printing. 
Oh, she printed. Oh. Yeah, she prints. And you cursive? Uh -huh. Yeah, and I heard they don't teach cursive in school anymore. No, that's not terrible. In, that's terrible, I know. Not in some schools. There's mm -hmm. a few schools that I heard that do. Yeah. And, I don't understand And that. I heard that they have some classes in college now to oh. learn cursive. Wow. Hey, you know, how could you be a postman? You and, can't read. Yeah, you have and to you could, I, I wrote a, on my grandson's birthday card one time. Mm -hmm. He looked at it. I says, what's the matter? He had a funny expression on his face. I said, what's the matter? He says, I can't read this. I had written cursive. Wow. He couldn't read it. How I old was he? His birthday card. Oh, he was maybe second, third grade, something like that. He said, I can't read this. Wow. Can't read cursive, yeah. That's a shame. Uh, 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 yeah. How, how could you be a postman if you, <laughs> if you didn't know cursive? Hmm. No? Mm hmm. I gotta look at the desserts. Okay. Okay.